Hey kids, welcome to Lesson 8, Boolean Expressions and If Statements, number three. Do it yourself. What's the secret number? Insert lines of code between the welcome and goodbye that do the following. Use prompt num to ask the user to enter the secret number. Add an if statement to check if the number is the secret. You can make up your own secret number. Use console.log to display a message if the user guessed correctly. Note, don't go overboard here adding messages. Just get practice adding a prompt and an if statement on your own. Make sure it works, and then we're going to move on. Well, this sounds very interesting. What I think we have to do here is add a prompt num for a secret number and set an if statement in our code down here to check for that number. Seems pretty exciting, so let's go ahead and dive in. I is always going to comment some stuff out here. My first part here is my intro. This is going to be my prompt down here. And then we'll end up with our goodbye. I know this code is short, but again, it's always good to get in the habit now. Let's start with our prompt or where we have to add our code. The first thing I know I need to do is to add a prompt. So let's drag our prompt in here. And this one is going to be secret. The display enter a value, or let's take guess what the secret number is, and a bunch of question marks. Our variable is secret, and that's going to bring our prompt box up there. Next, we're gonna to have to add an if statement in here because we wanna know if something happens. If something happens, we want a console.log message to display, wow, you guessed the number. Well, what is our number going to be? Well, secret, because that's our variable, and looking at our math over here, our operations, what I want it to be is exactly it. So I want it to be equal to. So I'm gonna put over here two equal signs. Now we have to guess a number. Hmm, what's a good number? Let's go with my age, 22. Hopefully, when our user enters a number, they'll get 22. If not, it'll say goodbye. We could get crazy here to display some other messages, but again, let's just make sure it is right. Let's go ahead and test this out and see if it works. Run, I guess the secret number. Let's do 22. Okay. Wow, you guessed the number. Hard part though. Let's run again and try any other number. 46. Hit okay. And just the two messages. Looks like our code is working exactly like we wanted it to. Looking back up here, we added a prompt to, an if statement, and a console.log message that displayed when the user got the number right. That was a lot of fun. I'm gonna assume here we're gonna build on this and have even more fun. Let's see if code.org wants anything else from us. No. Good job, kids. I'll see you on the next lesson.